Dragon Life, Life Plus, securing Leucorinia pectoralis and Pelopatis fuscus in the northern distribution area in Estonia and Denmark. Life project is an EU Life Plus uh, project, which uh, is uh, very special in a way that this is international project between Estonia and Denmark, mm -hmm. and it's a five-year project, and it is uh, mainly focused to two target species. One mm -hmm. is a dragonfly, Leucorina pectoralis, and another mm -hmm. one is uh, an amphibian, Pelopatis fuscus, and they both are uh, in decline, mainly all over their distribution range. To compile effective action plans for the two species, one overall aim of the project is to collect data on habitat requirements and distribution. Uh, when we started this project, uh, Leucorina pectoralis was a uh, rather poorly studied species here, so we didn't know much about its distribution and uh, there was almost no knowledge about the habitat requirements of the species, so this was one aim of the project to uh, find out where the species occurs, in which habitats, uh, and uh, Pelopatis fuscus is uh, a declining species. We have helped this uh, species in, in some areas already, but uh, uh, still quite a lot should be done to, to secure the species. Loss of habitat is the primary threat to the two project target species. To improve the habitat and breeding conditions of Pelopatis fuscus and Leucarinia pectoralis, as well as many other species, another overall objective of the project is to create or restore new small water bodies. 101 new ponds in Estonia and 76 ponds in Denmark are presently under construction. To secure genetic variation and avoid further local extinctions, breeding programs are undertaken. Eggs are collected in local ponds and hatched in laboratory, where survival rates of the tadpoles are close to 100%. Well on the way, and close to metamorphosis, tadpoles are released back into the restored and cleaned ponds where eggs were originally found. To help populations expand, also neighboring ponds receive tadpoles. In Denmark, reserve populations of Pelopatis fuscus are created within several Natura 2000 sites, where about 14,000 tadpoles would be released. <laughs> <laughs> 